morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Scottish Summertime. It's the first week of summer, and it's a glorious 6 degrees Celsius at 8 a.m. in the morning. Such wonderful weather. Yes, t-shirts and shorts time, or t-shirts and kilts time. We'll have to get out there and get some work done. The chickens are enjoying it too. Look at them. Never seen them so active this early in the morning. I love it. Even the rooster strutting his stuff there. Yeah, right. So, what are we going to get up to for summer? Well, as the game likes to tell you, on the first day of summer, it's time to make hay and enjoy the sunshine. So, we will be... And yeah, we are filling up on eggs. Look, slowly. Um, so, yeah. We've got um, one, two, three meadows to uh, mow. Plus the, um, the cow uh, pasture. However, before then, we've got a couple of fields. Oops, wrong one. That one. Got a couple of fields that are needing weeded. Field one has got weeds coming through on it. And field 25, which is the sugar beet field, has got weeds coming through on it. So we're going to get that done first. Uh, that won't take too long to do. Let's get these gates open. And we're going to use the Little International for this. One of the reasons I bought it was for running the sprayers. They don't need a lot of horsepower, although this thing does have 150 horses under the hood. Zoom in a bit. That's that. They're both filled already. Excellent. So, let's go straight up to uh, the sugar beet field, get that sprayed. It's only a little one. And we can get on with stuff. It's verifying. Look, our wheat field has come through nicely be a good coverage. The beats are through. Old. So we get these um, herbicides done. It means that uh, I have to worry about it between now and harvest. Do this all ourselves. No need to put a worker on this one. It's too small. So, what's been happening? Well, um, not a lot since I last saw you. We've added a couple of little bits and pieces around the farm. You'll spot them as we go around. Um, I've been waiting for the grass we collected and put into silage wrappings a couple of episodes ago. I've been waiting for that to uh, finish fermenting. We then need to shred those bales and get them into the silo that we're going to be using for holding all of the um, mixed ration. Oh, completely missed that corner. Uh, holding all the mixed ration materials and the mixed ration itself. So we've got to get that done. They need to shred some more hay into there. We don't have a lot of hay, actually. Actually, very restricted on hay. The sooner we can get to a, a harvest season, the better. Uh, not hay, straw. What am I talking about? 
got tons of hay. Got a quarter million litres of hay in the silo. Um, no, it's straw that we're short of. The sooner we can get to a harvest situation where we're collecting straw, the better. We'll need it for making the total mixed ration. I think we've got enough to get us through until the end of autumn. If we can reach the end of autumn um, with what we've got, then we are going to be very happy bunnies. Because once we start pulling the straw off the fields for the harvest, then we are going to be set to go right through until next autumn. Got more than enough grass to make any silage needs. So we don't need to worry about that. Um, grass that's not cut yet is what I mean by that. Um, we've got a lot of silage already. We need to shred the bales and get, get it into the, the silos. And what else do we need? Uh, so silage is taken care of, certainly for the rest of this year. Um, hay is taken care of through till next autumn. Straw is the only thing that we're really worried about right now. So. Looking forward to harvest season. I mean, we can always buy in a few bales of straw if we need to. We don't use very much of it in the TMR. It's the total mixed ration. So, it's not like there's a really pressing urgency for it. That's the sugar beet field done. I will put a worker on down here because we've got other things that we want to be getting on with. Um, no. Yeah, I think I'll use coarse clay. There we go. Right. So we're putting onto the field. Coarse generation. Load one. Uh, headlands around. Headland passes will do two. It'll help them to turn around at the end. Clockwise. Start headland passes. Headland corners. Turn. Overlap 12% is good. Pretty big. Um, two, actually 10% we can get away with. Uh, simple island bypass. Auto. 21 meter. Generate the course. There we go. And uh, first waypoint. Return. Yeah. Off you go. Let's make sure that he uh, gets started. All right. He. She. He. <laughs> Check there. <laughs> Turning blind in my old age. You just see the colour difference in the field there on the bit that he sprayed. It's a little bit darker. Right. Oh. Jump the boom. Right, we've got other jobs to get on with while he's doing that. Let's go get them done. Uh, one of the first things that we've got to do is we've got to go up to the shop and we've got to get ourselves a bale grab. Because those little bale spikes are not going to do the job the way that we want them to. I mean, they're great for moving single bales, but we want to move more than single bales. Just drop the actually 
probably need to put the weight on the back of the tractor. So if we're going to be moving multiple bales, not a huge tractor, but we're lifting multiples. That's a nice heavy weight, one and a half ton weight. So it'll help us immensely. And one of the other jobs that we've got to do today is we've got to survey the fields for the beekeeper, the apiarist, I believe is the proper name for them. He um, gave me a call and said, you see you've got your fields planted and they're sprouting. Um, I put my bees in your fields. And uh, it'll help your crops to get germinated, and it'll give my bees something to do, collecting pollen, and uh, give you a bit of income for me renting the use of your fields. I said, absolutely you can. He said, well, if you let me know where you want them, and then uh, we'll get them put into place. So I said, fine. And we're going to get that done things to do today. I keep forgetting that that ghost blocks the view on this thing. Be even more blocks when we uh, pick up the bale grab. Summer time and the farming is easy. Oh, oh exactly. Good, good idea. Because I couldn't sing to save my life. And I've just realised I'm driving American style. It's just as well nobody was coming down the road. Good God. Well, the police didn't spot me doing it either. Good grief. Spending too many hours across on um, Ravenport. Right, we haven't bought it yet, so let's get it bought. Um, tools. Front loader tools. Or it might be under bailing technology. I can't remember. It is. It's under bailing technology. That's the one we want. And yeah, it fits on the FZ30 and 60. So customize it. Uh, we want it for the front loader. We're going to have it in our color. Yeah, let's do that. 5,000. Perfect. Buy that, because we're going to get a lot of use out of this. Until the lads brought it out yet. Yeah. yeah, there it is. Great. They're very good, these lads. Very quick to bring things out of the store when you order them. Should have given them a bit more warning by ordering it from the farm, not once I was in the yard. getting out of the tractor. Uh, right now, where's the instructions? Uh, that's it. Put the bale spikes up there, especially for driving down the road, but also because we're not going to use them. Um, I'm just going to use the, the bale hooks to lift bales. Uh, oops. 
have to do that. Yep. It's a terrible view. Up a bit. Racing around the countryside at top speed in this thing with such an obstructed view. Not a smart idea, but a bit of a hurry this morning. Things will calm down tomorrow. It's just the first day of some of those jobs that I want to get out of the way. So, can't afford to hang around. So, where was it? Oh, yeah, we're talking about the bees. Yeah, I've got to do the survey for the bees. Some of that surveying we can do as we're going around. Um, I have to make special journeys for it. I already got some ideas for some of it. Um, I just got sailing. I did just go sailing past the farm. What a dipstick! Oh, I'm not with it at all today. You can tell I only had one cup of coffee before I left the house. Good grief! bit concerned about these silage bales because I was looking at them earlier and it said they still weren't fermented I'll take those top two out of there will it allow me to pick up threes I have to go external and use the drone here I think Actually, there's three on the bottom there that I can pick up and go. That's not square enough. More central would be good. Grab the bales is why I left the menu up because I need to remember these commands. Flight lift, flight, ooh, slight tilt, back it up a bit. A bit more tilt just to be sure. Gradually pull away from that wall so that we don't catch it on the turn. There we go. Come smack into the timber. We're still waiting for that lad to come get it. Let's give him a call and remind him about it. first initially I actually need to swing it around a bit this in the right position to go easier I put them there I believe to let go of them. Yep. Good. The last spray in the field's finished. It's been time actually because we need his tractor. We know we don't. We can do it with this one. Right. So. The bale grab there. Bale shredder. Hello, Worm and Trude. Coming to see what I'm doing. They're very nosy this morning. Go in 
flashlight. Swing it around. There. Lower it down. And to oh. time is getting to me. that the engine keeps running when we jump out. And I did put these the wrong way around. Never mind. It says grass when I lift it up. Did you notice that? Yeah? Full type grass, not silage. It's a little bit worrying. We'll see what happens, though. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, you go over there. You go over there. Ah... Uh, I don't know where that's gone. We'll have to go and rescue it. Now, if it drops into the silo as grass, I'm not that worried. So, um... So, uh, not overloading. Aye, there we go. And... I jump out while it's doing that. I look on here, what number is going up? It is the grass that's going up. So it definitely has not fermented. Rats. Well, we could do with keeping a bit of grass in there anyway. Just for um, adding to the cow's regular feed. Now, where did that bale go? I, I jump in on the overload pit. Uh, silage 15,000. Right, okay. Let's try something. There's the 8,000 off the bale. Actually, no, it's 4,000 per bale, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's 4,000 per bale. Oh, we don't need to use the bale shredder. We can just throw it in like that. Awesome. Right. In that case, we can back that way. In. Pick that up. We can go put this in here. Um, it over here for now, out of the way. We'll get that bale grab again. Right, I didn't realise we could drop the bales directly into that. It's, um, it's a hell of a difference. It's going to save us a lot of time lot of time. off the top first. I to grab him, wasn't it? Take it straight off the grab. It is. To make this job so much easier. Just check on the board. Should have gone into silage. Uh, row silage 23, 322, grass still 12,000. 
it looks like it did go into silos. So 23 two, two, two. If I put another two in there, that should go up to about 31. I'll get the two in the middle here. Yeah, 31322, so that did go to silage. Awesome. Now, before I continue much further with this, we need to go and get that guy, or that other tractor out of the field, the spray tractor. The sprayer's put away. Shouldn't need a wash. But, oh, leave that wall alone, for God's sake, you'll have it knocked over. the three bale lift. Right. Jump out of that. Won't get out of that track to sort it out. through there now? Oh, we can cut through there. I did clean it out. Jump the wall. Jump the fence. God, look at how athletic I am now. Couldn't have done that when we first got here. Right. So, it's uh, job done. Let's check what the PDA says. Weeds. No weeds on field one now. No weeds on weeds on field twenty-five now. Lovely job. And uh, nice even growth around all our fields. In fact, there should be a load of planting jobs come up a little bit later. Now, do we need to spray this or not? Yeah, it's looking a bit grubby. Give it a spray. therapy of cleaning your tractor in the sunshine did I tell you it's summer Look. Oh. barely a cloud in the sky a few thin wisps Get the forecast see what the forecast says as well oh. Don't want too dry a summer. We want some rain to help the, the crops grow. No way. Unless there's any contracts for them. Let's just quickly check the contracts board. See who's needing jobs done. No, there's only a couple of transporting jobs. Alright. Oh, there's plenty of the 
the young local lads that can do those transporting jobs so we'll leave them for them not that desperate for the money not right now anyway might be later in the year <laughs> Oh, they're nearly empty anyway, so they're going to need a, a full refill next job. That's okay. I'm trying to conserve money right now, so I don't want to refill them until I know we've got a contract that's going to pay us for it. Done our fields, that's all I was worried about. Shed and we'll carry on moving those bales. It's the end of the episode here already. I'm not even going to get the grass cut. If Oh, forgot to water the cows this morning. Better get that done as I'm going past. And on. On jump the gate. What's going on? There we go. Wow, they were thirsty overnight. Still running. There we are, that's it. Sorry girls, no straw. Still waiting for MJ to tell us how to fix the straw. Oh my god, look at this lot. Oh. the other thing you see if right anybody knows how to get this to drop right e what does the menu say uh, I can drop the object right show me how to empty the shovel right e I R um, Y Ed Oh Left click drop Oh hang on What was that? Oh no Leave it Back up a bit in the ass to be honest much prefer using this wait yeah oh. can't remember if with the brush when you clean it up if it puts it back in the trough or if it just deletes it. I've got a feeling it just deletes it. 
Right, what were we doing? Oh, these bales, yes. Now I'm moving them out of here because later in the year when we've got some money I want to put a proper feed mixing station in this shed. So, taking advantage of the early summer, get all the bales out. Because then that way we can just refill the, the mixing wagon direct from the silo without having to worry about shred bales and ratio of bales and all of that stuff. This is one of those jobs I've been meaning to do for ages. Never got around to it. Uh, it make the job easier for ourselves if we move these bales. I was trying to hold this straw to use as bedding, but until the bedding distribution gets fixed by MJ at MJ Modding, then there's not much I can do about it. Basically all, all of these straw bedding triggers on the map are broken. They just don't operate. So I'm going to continue on with this um, and I will catch up with you in the next episode which will be Thursday? Yeah, Thursday. So have a great week. This is the Gasbeard on Gatehead Farm. Busy, busy shuttling bales around while I enjoy the start of summer. And we'll get all the mowing and stuff done. I'll get all of this cleaned up. We'll get the mowing done on, um, on Thursday. Get that pulled in, put into the silo. converted silage I should say. What I might have to do is those silage bales that we've been storing in the silage pit I might have to move those up to the uh, the big shed on the top of the hill and just leave them to, to ferment but they're not going to ferment in the silage pit by the looks of it going to lift it nice um, yeah so I shall see you in the next one. Don't forget, usual routine, remind you all, just in case you've forgotten, give the video a like, leave your comments and questions down below. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to get a thousand subscribers. It would be lovely to do it before the end of the year, so share the link to the video. Um, but it's going to be a hard push. After 10 years, I've only got 600 subscribers. 10 years of YouTubing and I've only got 600 subscribers. My God, what's going on? Um, it would be lovely to hit a thousand for, uh, for the new year, Christmas or new year. Um, I'm not holding out my hopes. This would be nice, just saying, putting it out there. So share the videos, share the links, and um, I shall see you in the next one. Have a great week. Thanks all for being here. As I always say it's not goodbye. Just bye for now.